Hello everyone and welcome back to the basics of learning CW Morse code and how to have a conversation or QSO. Today we're going to answer a CQ. So we're listening to somebody else sending CQ and I'm going to walk you through how to answer for the first time. So you're going to be hearing someone call CQ, CQ, CQ from DE, from and then their call sign. And in this case I'm going to use uh, one of my Elmers, KQ9L. It's short, it's easy. Okay, so KQ9L is calling C CQ out there and we're going to answer him. CQ, CQ, CQ from KQ9L, KQ9L, KQ9L. K. He's going to write K and that means anyone, anywhere. And now we're going to respond back and say, hey, I'm right here. And that's all this video is going to do. Very basic, very short. Now, if you're hearing someone call CQ, you may very often find out that you won't have time before somebody else jumps in there and answers the call. So you have to be kind of quick. You have to think about how much time you have. Very often I'll have my notepad ready and I'll have a pen. I think it's very easy and very wise to write down uh, their call sign. I get as much info as I can before I call back. But remember the more time you spend the less likely a chance that they'll still be there so many times I've heard CQ, CQ, I open my book, I, I go to my page, and sure enough, someone else has gotten in before me, and they start a long QSO, and I've lost it. So, at the very least, get their call sign and write it down. That's the first thing I do. You might want to record the time, the date, and all that. That way you don't have to worry about it when you finally do get to talk to the person. Alright, so now we're going to answer this CQ with our own call sign, like this. KQ9L from N9YO, N9YO, AR. So we're, we're using their call sign to say, I heard you, from me, me, and then AR means, go ahead and respond. We haven't established a contact yet. So KQ9L, day, N9YO, N9YO, AR. And then you wait and listen. And very often what you'll hear back, if, they, if they've heard you, is you'll hear your call sign again. So let's listen to all of this together and see what it would sound like. Okay, so what they did is we've heard their CQ and now let's answer them. Okay, let's put together what we've learned so far. We're listening to someone call CQ. We're going to respond back, and I'm going to use my call sign to respond back. And then they're going to acknowledge that they heard you, and that's where this video will end. In future videos, we will go further and have the QTH, RST, and name, and all that, and the third, third go around. But for right now, let's put together what we've learned. All right, KQ9L is calling CQ. And so then we are going to answer him. Now he responds back with this. Good morning. Thanks for a call. And here is where the conversation will start. And we'll cover that in later videos. Let's do this one more time all together. Here's me responding to the CQ. And now, finally. 
finally, here's KQ9L saying, Okay, I heard you. Now let's start talking. Okay, and that's where we would continue talking and it would get more advanced later. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to make many more just like it and even more advanced. Thank you, Teacher Tom. That was wonderful. And thank you, students, for watching this video. Please smash that like button and let us know what other kinds of videos you would like to see.